Okay, it's a beautiful autumn evening. I'm uh, on what we call the Humplety Hill, which is uh, going to be my remote venue for this evening's attempt to uh, communicate over the ether. Um, there's my, my bikes there. I've got the rig in the back of the back of the trailer. I'll probably try and flash that up again. I'm gonna flash up the video again in a minute to show you when I've put it together. Sorry, it's another gloomy one. The the low light, I'm not sure if there's a low light on this camera, but um, I'll have to give it a try. It's a beautiful evening. Um, uh, fairly warm now, cycled up a long way. Although we live just literally almost where that light in the middle of the shot is. We're just up from there, so it's not very far at all, which is great. It's just a big climb, but that's also the point really. Right, so I'm gonna try and get myself set up, get on 38 and see if any of the fine gentlemen that I listened to a couple of weeks ago are there. I'll probably try and catch a bit of the conversation. I'm a bit nervous about um, recording too much of what people say because I think it's uh, maybe not best um, practice. Uh, I'm not quite sure whether I'm in a place where I want to ask them if they're okay to be filmed. So um, I'll, I'll just try and, uh, I'll try and give you a flavour if I can hear anything without um, maybe giving too much of their lives away. <laughs> Uh, or violating their, their privacy. All right, I'll be back in two ticks. Right, so I'm all, I'm all set up. Um, there's my uh, there's my aerial. <laughs> there's my ground plane. Nice tea tray. Uh, my um, electric bike battery. Taking a feed off the charging socket here. Uh, DC to DC, 36 to 13.8 volt converter. Um, and here's my, my radio, let's turn that on, all working reasonably well by those things, so yeah, uh, that's that really, I, I would have come up on the electric bike and use it pretty much on, on board, but uh, unfortunately she's off the road at the moment because she's got brake problems, so um, I used the, um, I rode up on the special, so that's fine. So yeah, um, I'll uh, tune in to 38 and see if there's anyone that I was uh, hoping to see. Back in a bit. I uh, got some contact. Everything's just come alive. I'm getting a lot more here uh, than I was back at home. This is to be expected. That's really good. All right, I'm going to key up in a minute and actually say hello if I can. Second contact. Uh, I've been speaking to people and they've been hearing me pretty well. And this rig seems to work quite well. Five and nine, five and seven, I'm going back. So, um, yeah, successful evening so far. Don't think I'm disturbing any of the neighbours too much, hopefully. <laughs> um, so we'll see how we go. I may have to come up with some kind of solution which doesn't involve uh, people hearing me out loud, uh, but we'll see. Okay, well, I'll get back to the uh, chat. Okay, that was a fairly successful uh, session. There's my bench. The lights of Gloucester in the distance. I was getting out from here. Quite, qu oh god, oh my god, I'm completely stuck in my trailer now. Oh, come on. Oh, I don't want to do that. Yeah, that oh, was happened again. Am I still stuck? Ooh. Right, this is the downside of uh, this is the downside of, of, of remote operation. Right, I'm going to just stop the filming for a second. I think I've turned you upside down as well. Oh, hang on. Right, right and back. Okay, I've got I've got out. So yes, there's my bench. There's Gloucester. There's the thing I just got stuck on that little lump underneath the bench. And this is the road. This is the road down the hill. So I might try and give you a, a flavour of what what I, what I do to get home. Just I just got to roll down this hill. Trying to keep everything under control. You can see the 
there you can't really see the dip. the view is absolutely spectacular actually oh it's a bit dodgy this is rather dodgy down 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 there we go using using my back brake only so oh, I can let, let go a little bit now okay and I've got to turn back on myself here uh, super dodgy doing this with it holding a camera trying to film and film and ride at the same time is probably not even legal uh, so yeah sorry about that okay. keeping my speed under control so we're just going down down the hill a little bit and then just here where those two those red bollards are I've got to turn back on myself again and then that's the last hill that's someone on my tail I'm just going to let them go I'm trying to get over this curb without killing myself down we go oh my god Oh, this is pretty sketchy. Uh, if, I, if it all suddenly goes dead, that means I've had some kind of horrendous accident. But giving my back brake a decent workout, and it leaves it locking up a little bit. Still going down, 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 down the lane. So it really isn't far, like this is at the bottom of this lane is basically back in the valley where we live. It's super close. And that was really good fun, yeah. So I was getting out to getting out to um Gloucester. Everyone seems to be in Gloucester actually. I think the uh I think there's a radio society over there, that's where it all that's where it all happens. So um oh yeah, there we go. Some more houses and the lights yeah that's where it all happens so I think that's why all the boys are from over that way um, I think some of them were super close to each other actually they were kind of ra radio using their radios but they could probably just pop round and um, just sort of talk to each other <laughs> but um, yeah a really friendly bunch they seem to be on every uh, they say they're on every night so um, yeah, so I suppose I can probably just pop up there whenever I, whenever I want, feel like it. I suppose they seem pretty uh, relaxed about that and just joining in when you want, which is nice. So we'll see how it goes. It's just a bit of a shame that, uh, bit of a shame I can't really get out from my house, but that's just that's just the way it is, isn't it? Because um, it's line of sight with CB. So if you if you will buy a house in the valley. You're not going to get out anywhere apart from the end of the valley which is kind of pointing straight at nowhere so this is the last little bit of hill oh god this is going to be tough i don't know if i can do this i um, i'm accelerating I need to... sorry i was uh i was accelerating and braking at the same time which is uh, never a good sign so i had to use both hands all right let me just see if i can um just roll down this last bit. Uh, just to give you an impression of how close it is to where I live. I've got good good brakes on this bike as well. This is my uh, this is the mountain bike. I fitted some. Uh, I think they're XT. They're old XT hydraulic brakes. They're pretty tasty. Uh, but I'm going to have to use my other hand again in a minute. This is bad filming. Yeah, this is rubbish filming again. But that's it, really. I'm down. That's it. Right. I'm down. I'm back. Back in the valley. So it's that close. So it's just down the hill. Um, uh, or up the hill. Which is the difficult part, but then... You get the joy of radio at the top, so there we go. I'll stop that now.